What's up there? How you doing there, folks? Welcome back to the crypt, and let's uh, let's get into it. This is a uh, this is uh, from July eighth, so about two days ago. Uh, Instagram stream, and it's, it's titled "Something Happened." Hey, Rebecca, what's up? But anyway, thank you all for being here and like the stream, folks. And I hope everyone's having a good night. Hey, Ross. You guys Something can hear me bad better, in the right? Something's happening right now, and I don't know what it is. Uh. Welcome. So I saw this video and I wanted to play it because she said something bad happened. I'm like, oh my God, they, those kids, you know, because to this woman, that should be the first thing, the only thing on her mind, right? You would think so. Um, so let's see, like, what, what is, what is the bad, the, the, the news? Like, what is so bad that happened? Something really bad happened <laughs> while we were sleeping, guys. Yep. <laughs> Thank you. And let me just, let me just. I'll just I'll just say it. The former prime minister of Japan, Shinzo Abe, got assassinated today. What? That's that's what this is about. So I mean, like, yeah, it, it, it's a it's it's a fortunate, you know, set of circumstances anyone gets uh, assassinated. But really, Shani. You're crying over something that you can't control instead of crying over something that you could control. Okay. Uh, again, I'll say that the former prime minister of Japan got assassinated no, I heard today. you the first time. And, and I'm crying for it because I'm feeling for the people of Japan right now. Why can't she feel for her kids ever? <laughs> You know, she cries for her friend. She cries for the prime minister of Japan. And she cries for the Japanese people. And that's fine. But again, why can't you just show a little bit of tears for those children that had to deal with uh, physical and mental abuse for, you know, God knows how long? Awful. I love Japan. Hey, dude. I'll just say that. First and foremost, I love Japan. I've <laughs> very much right? have loved their culture since I was a little girl and following their culture. And Shinzo Abe was such a good fucking man. <laughs> She's up on the world events, yeah, right. <laughs> hey, I, you should always get all your world events from Sh from Shani. You didn't deserve to die. Shot oh yeah, that's like right. That. That's right, because she's Japanese. <laughs> and I'm scared because something's going on with our world leaders. Like Boris Johnson just quit. Biden, well, he, he's he, he's neither on this earth or in heaven. He's just like out there, just. Wow, I'm gonna get food today. Whoa, that's it. Cool. Sounds like your boyfriend. <laughs> cool, dude. That's that's Biden, just completely dementia up. Not that I'm making fun of him. I'm not. I feel bad for the man. Yeah, sure you do. But it, it's 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 scary right now. I'm fucking scared. I'm hey, fucking Martin. scared. Like people are losing their minds. Where they're now gonna start. Well, that's that's kind of how I was feeling about this, but you know, I mean, obviously she don't give a shit. It is for you know the views and the clicks and all that stuff, but it just bothers me that she actually doesn't ever make just streams for like you know like oh I feel bad or I need to get I got rev I kicked him out of the house you know he really needs help or she needs help just anything it's just nothing and it's just like she don't give a shit about those those children that she, that she brought into this world and kind of just left to the wolves you know what i mean it's awful and they are taking shots at our fucking leaders and shinzo abi was such a good <laughs> man well you know i don't know if you guys know shani claims that she was on epstein island yes you you heard that correct she she says her mom brought her there so she knows how those kids were over there and like yes that, that sounds absolutely batshit ridiculous but that's shanny <laughs> she just makes up all these narratives in her head 
I mean, really, the ridiculous stuff I heard her say in the past three years. Man, I could write a book. He did good for his people. And okay. Hold on. I. I take notice. And and I also have, um, if anyone was interested in the description, there's a. Uh, I have, I do have the a merch. I always forget to to promote it, but I do have merch from Spreadshirt. And, um, but yeah, I'll, I'll throw out some links. I love people who take care of their people when they're running. I clean it for you. We still have this? Yes, we do. Oh my God. This, this is worth so much money. It means a lot, a lot to me. Wait, is this mine? <laughs> I love it. Her intention span is so short. She went from, oh my God, the people in Japan. Oh my God. Uh, he, he got assassinated. And, oh, what is this? This is mine? Like, <laughs> what happened to you caring so much? Where'd it go? Of course it's yours. Yeah. Hey, what's up, Gary? I do I remember that. I know you remember that. It's famous. I probably could make a lot of money off this. Yeah. I know exactly <laughs> who would buy it, too. Yeah, I know who would buy it, too. Psycho. <laughs> That's so awful about Shinzo Abbey. I need to show you. Look. But yeah. Wow. Yeah. Sh shot him straight in the fucking chest, dude. Uh, to the people of Japan, I am so sorry. Yeah. Condolences because he was a good man. He, you're, the people of Japan, you're a peaceful people. You're a beautiful people. And your culture is absolutely beautiful. Yeah. And I'm so sorry. I know there's some people from Japan who watches me. There will I'm really be. sorry. Listen, there will be war if this was some other actor. It's coming to piss. If this was another state actor, there will be war. <laughs> and it is. And they will absolutely destroy them. <laughs> hey, Gavin! Stop it with a box. Stop scratching. Gavin! Thank you. You're a good boy. Come here. <laughs> The good oh my god thank you bro you're so bad yeah you know what the funny thing Monty is uh, I hope I'm pronouncing that right if you look at her at her Instagram it says yes I am the real Shani for Christ and don't listen to anyone else about me I am real I'm stoner mom and I, I don't know what stoner mom means <laughs> especially in a state where you're not supposed to be doing that but um she's like don't listen to anyone and i am real it's we don't no one's listening to anyone else we're listening to you man just get that through your head we're listening to what comes out of your mouth you and and that little boyfriend you got there that golem <laughs> there's something going on with our leaders okay this is no coincidence no. oh really Boris johnson quits no and resigns and and then shinzo abi gets shot it's not a coincidence oh she's crying over japan um yeah, well, we knew it wasn't going to be for the children. But yeah, she's crying over uh, a prime minister got assassinated. Because to her, that's more important than, uh, you know, sh shedding a tear for her child that's autistic, that got, you know, drop kicked in the ribs. No, I don't think it is. I don't know what the connection could be, but there's a connection. Oh, that's awful. Well, we got the two big people from World War II. Hey, England Jelly Bean. And, and Japan. Japan, of course, took the hit. Sure. You know, everyone wanted Boris Johnson out because he was just a reminder of fucking Trump. Oh, he hisses. He's a snake, I'll tell you. He's a snake. I hate Trump. He took all that money that people gave him thinking that they'll overturn hey, the election. And just spent it on him. Do you know himself. what the Patriots say on him? The what? Patriots say him too. Yeah. You know why? Why? He would not come to anybody's rescue over January 6th. They all had him in jail. Yep. And you know what? I want to show you something, Jelly Bean, real quick, since you're here. Because I don't know if you ever got to figure this out. Uh, you were trying to become a member. Uh, if you can see on my screen right here, you see right here where it says join? That's where you would join. So it says my name, and then if you're subscribed, and then next to it, there's a join button. So that's where you would, that's where you would do that. But I just wanted to show you that, if you didn't figure that out. Including 
The one dude from Vince. No. Vince I didn't take my braids okay. out. They're still there. I just have it in the back of my head, like my hair. You remember Joe Biggs, honey? Joe Biggs, the guy, he's in jail right now. <laughs> and Trump doesn't do anything for him. That Dan's like, well, I can't. I don't want to talk about Trump, really. Alex Jones was mm-hmm. fucking smart just standing outside the Capitol saying, stop, well, stop. General, yes, it is. It's General Sunday. Jones. <laughs> stop. He said, stop, guys. Stop. <laughs> okay. You're going to. Oh my god, I can't believe I just co- I'm in the middle of this. Yeah, he got himself into that shit. He did. No! <laughs> That's why I don't go with the crowds, dude. Yeah, hey man, you're right. You're right. The General, I'm, I'm, General Jones was saying stop and they wouldn't. Nah, I'd rather be rogue for the rest of my life than be with the crowd. Johnny Silver here. No affiliation. Thank you, Nintendo. Yeah. You guys are so sweet. I want to thank you for listening to me blubber about this stuff. I'm <laughs> blubber. Because it's, it's just... <laughs> Hey, Aries. What's up, bro? I love Japan so fucking much! We've been watching nothing but Inuyasha. Right? It's it's, it's their culture. Oh my god, their beautiful culture. Mm -hmm. People are going to say, oh my god, you think Inuyasha is Japanese? No. I, I don't know, uh, Monty. I I thought it was the fetish whip, actually, at first. Uh, I don't know. It looks like it's some sexual thing. I really couldn't tell what she was kind of holding up. It was just, it looked like it was a bunch of stuff wrapped in her, wrapped in her nasty hands. So <laughs> if I get further clarification, I'll, I'll let you guys know. But yeah, I was wondering that too. Oh. I'm saying their anime is in the style of Japanese. Well, the thing stuff. is, oh, no Yasha talks about the feudal times culture, right? How it was. Exactly. And it was just simple farm people. Just yeah. Oh, I know. You had to go to the browser if you're on, um, if you're on uh, an Apple, an iPhone. But if you're on a computer, like a, a PC or a Android, then that's how it comes up. But if you go to the browser on iPhone, you should see it like that, and then you just click on join. Just like the Irish, and they pretty much. In the demons, they believed in angels. They and, believed in and instead of growing potatoes, they grew rice. Right. <laughs> what is she talking about? They were just a simple people, and I would personally like to thank your audience. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. I want to personally thank every. Wow. I want to personally thank everybody that that loves Shani and gives her support emotionally over everything. But seriously, your donations are really appreciated. That's all I'm gonna say. Like, thank you. We got gas in the car, finally. I see on the gauge three gallons of gas in the car, and I'm going crazy happy, you know? I know, we got gas in the car. Praise Jesus oh, Christ. I know. <laughs> I have a doctor's appointment coming up. Yeah, you do. I gotta go to the dyno. <laughs> Is it the 11th? Uh, I know. The 15th, okay. Allegedly. I gotta get my uterus uter- hey. scraped down. They're checking for cancer there. <laughs> I know, just only Shani's upset about it. <laughs> yep, they scrape it. Oh no, that's fine. Don't ever feel stupid. Well, the thing is that that lining's gonna be pushed out anyway during your period. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, I, I get it. So, right. Basically, if you think about it, if women were chickens, that is their egg. That placenta type? I mean, like, again, CPS is watching every video she's putting out there. She has 30 days to turn her life around and show them a safe, healthy, clean environment for those children to grow up in. I haven't seen anything, Carrie, personally, to you know, to warrant that, to be like, okay, you made some changes. Rev got some anger management, maybe possibly you. Because I, I know there's more to that, that story. This doesn't make sense with the charges. And, you know, it, it looks like you're trying to get them back. But no, that's that's not working. The period. The period. Yeah. That is their egg. Sure. So we eat uh, chicken, period. Ha! You, yeah. Ha! They constantly have a period. Because yeah. they have an egg every right? day. Yeah. <laughs> you know what's really trippy, though, about humans and... and, and ovaries and eggs and stuff is we were inside our grandmothers oh i'm getting that because our our, when you're created you have all your eggs in you so technically you're in your grandmother when your mom is being conceived wow what that's (laughs) Uh, uterine scraping although it's dreadful will not cause cancer (laughs) (laughs) to watch the world burn nora to watch the world burn. 
It hurts. Well, I got theories on right, certain Kristen. procedures that they're just not good for you. No, it's it's needed. No, I am sure it is to catch you during cancer. Yeah, it's needed. I, I, I gotta be careful. It just every fucking word I say. The thing is, it's like what they put in you. You, you know. Hey, raccoon. How, how can I explain? It, it's like this. <laughs> you know how a mascara wand is? Yeah. It's like it, how it looks. It's yeah. like a big ma mascara wand that they scrape you down with. Oh, you okay. showed me the instrument. I think. Y yeah. Uh, no, I showed you the speculum. You can't yeah, you that. did. But I, you should, there were several tools on that page. That Our car jack. The female car jack. The speculum. <laughs> She's downstairs. <laughs> God, it is. Though. That's that's the best way I can explain what a speculum is. It car jacks your cervix, so it, so the doctors can go into your uterus. I'm just gonna say that's barbaric for this day and age. Yeah, there should be a better way to do this. Like, right? I don't know. Ultrasounds? Those are expensive. Lasers. Like non-lethal laser pay. I'm sure they, we should have that by 2022. Right. Are, are you expecting the medical industry to care about women right now and women health? Definitely not. At all. But I, I mean for <laughs> years and years. It's, it's, it's even harder. Is everything okay? Um, it's the world. But it's a blessed morning for us. My God. Blessed. You, you could try it. I don't know what that is on her forehead. It's been there though ever since. Tie your hair. I mean, it's it's my hair is not like it, it's a mess right now. But no, I woke up early, and then I turned on the news. Or I didn't turn on the news, but I was looking through my daily news that I do every morning. You know, that's usually the first one of the first things I do is read the news. Um, God, I'm fucking old. I'm like, that's the first thing I do is I read the newspaper, except it's on the internet now. Exactly. I used to read the newspaper when I was a kid. I love that shit. You're an old soul. I, I am. I did, I did that too. I, I, I am. I found out that Shinzo Abe, the Japanese prime minister, got assassinated today. Shot right in the heart. This and this is directly right after Boris Johnson resigned. So I'm fucking scared. I, uh, it raised huge red flags for me, like, what the fuck is going on? And I love Japan so much that it, it, it's breaking my heart. Um, I mean, we're talking about, I, I, oh my God. Gavin, well, you stop it. Stop scraping the box with your nails, sir. You know, that, that poor animal probably never gotten... You know, they never go to the vet. They never do anything for those cats. So I'm sure they, you know, that, that Gavin probably has, you know, uh, nails galore and, you know, never got, never got shots. You have to stop that, Gavin. We need to get <laughs> Yes, Yes, moles. Okay. Well, yeah. yeah. We don't have any money for Or it's hep. Gavin, you got to stop, okay? He oh, thank one. you, Joey. Come here, baby. I want him to have one too. Come on. Come here, handsome man. He's like a child. He is. <laughs> Yeah, you know what? I thought so. No, <laughs> you know, yeah, you can have that. You know what she said? She said that that means she's God's anointed. Jellybean has just donated one dollar and ninety nine cents through Super Chat. Thanks for everything. Oh, you're quite welcome, Jellybean. Thanks for being here. The news gives me anxiety. I have to tread lightly. Oh my God, or tread carefully. Yeah. Yeah, the Japanese prime minister was <laughs> shot dead today. It's scary. This world is so scary. It's like, what? I like I. Shinzo Abe was so good for Japan. Like, why would you do that? What was the point? What did he do? He's been leader for a long time. I know. A long time. Why would anybody do this? That's what I'm saying. Is it a state actor? Is it, is it, is it like Taiwan? Yeah, there's. It can't be Taiwan. That's China. China. Or China. Is it Korea? North Korea. Korea and Japan have a really bad relationship. Well, that's definitely true. I love learning all this world knowledge like, um, from her. <laughs> one of my dad's friends he used to work with, an awesome guy. Just awesome guy. They they, they, they spent uh, 30 years in Japan on base. Thank you, Jelly Bean. Well, I appreciate and, it. Um, they they were telling me how, but yeah, she she told me that this was like she would tell everyone this is God's anointed like they, like she was touched by God and that's why that big war or whatever I don't know what it is it's just huge and I can't stop staring at it. <laughs> Japan and Korea are always at like up arms with each it other. It could be yeah. a rash, and like they have certain words for 
Korean women and Korean yeah, women have certain words That's for sad. Japanese women. Like, oh, I love yeah. him. Yeah, they downgrade each other constantly. Um, <laughs> Trying it, to run away. To that level <laughs> of of hate where they're degrading the women with the countries. So it's <laughs> like that. I just what my concern is. He was at the Nagasaka, na, Nagasaka, Nagasaki, Nagasaki. Thank you, Nagasaki um, base. Okay. Um, <laughs> my, my only concern is if it's a state actor, then you're going to have a war. Did you hear about the author of Yu-Gi-Oh? He drowned last week. Oh, my God. Yeah, that happened. China and Japan don't like each other either, but no one remembers why anymore. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's why, why, I, I don't think I ever knew why they had a thing. China and Japan. Well, I feel that same way with the U.S. and Russia. Like, why are we fighting each other? Communism. The, the specter of communism. Yeah, but the thing is, is a lot of people in this country are communists, so it's like... They are now. In the oh! Oh, you're talking about this this thing. Yeah, I started to notice that. I'm like, are you wearing a wig? Because this looks like something like Foodie Beauty has. Like, um, yeah, yeah, I, I, I see what you're saying. Yeah, that does look like some nasty rash thing she got going on there. She's been thrown out of the country if you were communist. Or put in jail for being a communist. That's the truth. It's just a political position. Yeah, it's like ringworm. <laughs> well, and, and government. Yeah. Both. yeah. I don't care if it's democratic, communist, or anything. I don't care. As long as I can have something in my stomach and a place to stay, I'm content. You know, but to start wars and kill your fellow man over this bullshit, yeah. these political ideologies, <laughs> these experiments, as they like to put them, Again, Firefly, seven hundred grand, but never wanted to go to the dentist to to fix them chompers. You know, she could have took five thousand of that, and or even ten thousand, and got some really nice veneers. It's incredible that she had all this money, and the last thing on her mind was to get those teeth fixed. Just saying. <laughs> First of all, she's I, a ooh. lobby. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I I see it now. Yeah, I I see it now. It's kind of like comes like out and goes around. Oof. Sorry, it's really per it's yeah, it's really it's red. Now I'm really looking at it. Chanch, Sinzo Sin Abi got such a good man. How about a shout? <laughs> right in the heart. He was assassinated. Right in the fucking heart. This just happened, though, right? That like, wow. It's a huge deal. Right. It is a huge deal. He, yeah, it's huge and it's scary. And this is right after Boris Johnson resigns. There's something, a connection there. I know it. Well, he may have said, you're doing what? No way. Maybe they threatened if he doesn't resign, they do the same to Shinzo. Oh. You never know. These black leaders. What? The hidden ones, the ones oh, that are at the, the top. The, the hand. Yeah, yeah why know. am I up so early? I just, I woke up. Couldn't, I, I crashed last night early. I crashed. I'm like, I'm tired. I'm going to sleep. And revs too. I'm not old enough to remember, but I think I remember something about China and Japan having beef over NATO. Yeah, it's always NATO, isn't it? Yeah, NATO. It's always fucking NATO. <laughs> what do you mean? Yeah, who needs teeth? Yeah, or the UN. <laughs> right. Warmongers. Yeah. Like, you, you guys claim you're fucking all together. And, and you cause our young men to go to war and battle. Like, what the fuck is that shit? And not only that, the Georgia Guidestones are gone. Yeah, what is they the took them down. They took them down. They're gone. They're gone. They're gone? They're gone. This is the second time they've talked about this. They're gone. What the hell's going on? I don't know. That's my question. What is going on? Yes. Maybe we're about to be invaded. <laughs> yes. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. Yeah. yeah. She 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 cares little to other people and how they feel about the things she says. But yes, you caught that right. By aliens. Talk about a dog whistle, right? I'm still waiting for the aliens, dude. I'm still waiting for that. It's in their, it's in their little plan book. Yeah. <laughs> They've already done the Georgia, the Georgia Guidestones are torn down. That was in their little plan book. Or they know an armada's coming. A huge armada. Uh, yeah, Robin, you can't spam stuff. So that's that, part of the uh, rules. So I, that, that's one. YouTube rules. If Sorry coming, about that. Coming. Aliens. Yeah. Like, what could they can't hide it if there's they, armada? Well, they really aren't hiding it anymore. They can't hide it. Do you know how many videos, especially in um, the, uh, the South America areas they it's every day i'm seeing videos from south america and the ufos and they're real too these are just fucking iphone like cell phone fucking videos yeah 
it's nuts. We're living in sci-fi. Yeah, that's the truth. Yeah, it's been more than a century. I mean, she doesn't have to spend much nowadays. It's not like how it used to be. She can get some nice plastic teeth, and it would look better than what she's got now. <laughs> China and Japan has always battled each other. They have. They've always battled each other. <laughs> okay, <laughs> sir. I don't. I don't like. I don't. Oh, like hey, Penny, what's up? I don't like. I don't like. I don't like China very much. I don't like what they do to the women. I don't like how they force abortions on women and they pretty much starve their fucking people. They and... steal people's organs. Yeah, they steal the their The government organs. doesn't. And then they take the fetuses and plate them with gold and sell them to rich leaders. It's so fucking gross. Oh, crap. It's so gross. They act like aliens. <laughs> yep, the U.S. released official video of UFOs last year. Yeah, but the thing is, is like, this stuff is like, I'm, I I saw a couple of UFOs like last time I went out. Did you? Yeah, Remember? You meant, yeah, you meant. Yeah, I said they're in the sky. Look at that. Holy shit. Like, yeah, you said it's right in the Valley Mountains. Mm -hmm. I thought, I believe UFOs love mountains for some reason. Yeah, they do. They love mountains. I don't know why, but they do. Um, they hover hey, around. Hey, Josh. Gavin, Gavin please stop. Can you stop yelling yeah. in my ear? I'll do it. Gavin. Drugs, sir. Folks. Come here. <laughs> do I have to clip your nails, sir? I think you do. Oh, uh, see? Yo, didn't, didn't I call it? I didn't even see this video. I figured that cat had long-ass nails. You know, why else would be scratching the hell out of that, that cardboard box it calls a litter box? Do I have to clip your nails? I will. I know, baby. It's just getting really weird, this world. Do you know where we're going in this world, dude? Another big war. I don't want another war. I don't want any more bloodshed. Well, it's either that money or it's going to be alien scum. And it's going to be I'd rather have fucking aliens than fucking war. <laughs> <laughs> alien scum. Fuck a war. It's, it's never good for anything. Oh, it's My great. son is... Mountains are trees. Huh. Interesting. My son is going to Area 51 for his honeymoon. Oh, my God. That's cool. That's really cool. He's not digging in his litter box. He's, like, you know... Oh, so is, does that happen in this video? Because, yeah, that's great. You know, Gavin's like, I'm out of here. It's probably so hot in there and smelly and nasty. No Scraping food his nails for the on animal. The box and we have Straight yeah, he's shredding the box pretty much, and and we have like pieces of cardboard that we're constantly picking up from. Right. <laughs> Poor watermelon. The dude needs a scratching post. He's using the box as a scratching post, which is better than the freaking door or the rug. Of course, he stays in the box. No. And Gavin's all embarrassed now. He took off. He's like, I'm sorry. No, no, he's in trouble. So hopefully he'll stop that. Good cat. He is a good cat. He was so sweet yesterday. He just went right on our, like, right in the middle of our pillows, like, right in between us, and just slept there all night. Here, sure, Gavin. Yeah, come here. You want, you want to show yourself to the people? Come yeah, on. come get love, Gavin. Here you go. So here you go. Say hi. Yeah, say hi, Gavin. I got you. Cares more about this cat than her children. Yeah, I can never be mad at me. Yeah, Gavin. Say hi, Gavin. He's like, no, I want daddy. <laughs> he is a precious boy. Yeah, he's a precious baby, yeah. Uh, no, not really. I think because she had, they have most of the fans in that room. He's a precious boy. We love him. He's a good boy. Yeah. Thank you for not scratching. He's the best of boys. He really is. And they wear the same clothes like, every hello, day, I'm if you haven't noticed. Cat. And I get them my love in for the morning. I get my love. Yes, I get my love for the morning. Yeah. Yes, I do. Oh. Yes, I do. Thank you. We, we got that on video. Yeah. We got that on video of you kissing me. Mm -hmm. Handsome. I'm telling you, every every time someone watches Shani, the, the Shani effect comes in, and they're like, man, I really need to clean my house. I really need to wash more. But I washed yesterday. But I, wanna, I just need it. I need a scrub. Because <laughs> you realize, hey, I don't want to be like this. Do I look like this? Do I come off like that? You know? It really does help out everyone but Shani. <laughs> <laughs> he has a glow-in-the-dark alien tattoo. That's awesome. Yeah, glow in the dark tattoo. I want to get actually. I want to get the glow in the dark tattoo of the Triforce <laughs> right on my hand. I've always wanted that. <laughs> From the Legend of Zelda. Gavin is a wonderful cat. He really is. He's a good boy. The Triforce technically is a symbol of the Trinity. Hi, baby. He's stealing the loves. He's stealing the loves. He's like, I love everyone. As a good boy. As a good boy. The baby. The baby. He's yeah. shedding like crazy though. Yeah, I know. So is watermelon. Ugh. Screwing with my sinuses. Because it's been so hot. Yeah, I know. 
I get it in my ton too. His hair. Yeah, I know. It, it sucks. Hey, Tia. Oh, thank you guys for being supportive. Like this is scary right now. Like I'm, I'm, I'm hoping the aliens come and save us from this fucking human madness. I'm, at, I'm at that point. Yeah. Now just, just imagine when CPS watches this, and she's gonna, they're gonna like talk to their kids and be like, so your mama believes uh, an aliens coming down, huh? And and uh, she's really big into uh, J Japan and stuff. Nothing about you, but you know. <laughs> Like really, it's going to just look bad, no matter her what her opinion is on all this stuff. It's just not gonna look good. Yeah, well, her hands definitely bigger than Rev's. I'm at that point. Can we can we have our alien? I need to brush my hair. Jesus Christ, it's all like, over the place. Can we get our alien invasion? Yeah, can we get our <laughs> alien invasion right now so I can like deal with it? Well, you know, Snarky, oh. I'll tell you. The fact that they can't even wash themselves, you know that that animal is not getting taken care of at all. You're gonna pounce. Get her. Get her. Not Get her, cleaning Gavin. the cat box. Oh my god, baby. Watermelon's gonna start screaming every time they play. She starts screaming. <laughs> yeah, right. Just leave her on the ground, have it pull her. <laughs> She's a boxer too. I wish we could have. <laughs> he ran. You you got him. You yeah. got him, Watermelon. He that, ran. That round was one by Watermelon. And she licked herself on the shoulder as soon as after, like, yeah. I did it. Yeah. Oh, no, no, it's perfectly <laughs> fine. It's them playing. I love watching them play. I love watching the cats play, too. <laughs> That's is it Watermelon's turn to pounce? Might be. She's like, you can't get one up on me on that. I love how they take turns pouncing each other. Yeah. Playing their escape. <laughs> Trident. Uh, I guess so. I don't know what Trident means. Well, you said Triforce. Oh. Well, I, I mean, Trident, that's the the, the thing that... The three-pronged thing that Poseidon uses to get. Correct. Yeah. Correct. I'm talking about, like, the Triforce is a triangle. That's what it is. It's a triangle. That was yeah. a little fancy. Cats are adorable. I love cats. They're everything to me. You love our babies. They're everything to me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm sure that's exactly what it looks like if we were able to see on the ground over there. Oh, we, we, we are a, a consumer of cat content. Both of them have to go to the I bathroom in it. And guinea pig. And hedgehogs. I love hedgehogs. <laughs> They're so cute. They're so cute. I love how they turn into a ball and then you like bring food in their presence and they pop out of their little ball. It's so cute and they get so excited. And they, <laughs> they like you. Their legs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're awesome. They're nails. <laughs> Yeah, Baptized, she's just always, you know, like it's, yeah, <laughs> she never inhales. <laughs> oh, you're talking about the vape. I got a lab dog and a cat about the way she everywhere. Talks. Oh my God, I know. Yeah. Especially this time of year, it's just everywhere. They shed constantly. Yeah. You should have seen our bathtub, because they like drinking in the bathtub. Mm. Don't ask me why, they just do. Well, no, the cats have always been everything to her over those kids. You know, they've always been cats first, then rev. And then all the way at the bottom is the children. They prefer it to the bowl. <clears throat> Shanny, no bullshit. I just got a wheelchair. Best thing ever. I get around so much easier. It sucks, but I'm more independent with the chair. I want one so bad. I want a wheelchair so bad. I think next time I go to my doctor, I'm going to ask him, is there a way you can put a prescription in for me to get a wheelchair? Because I really need one. Uh, your medical can get you a wheelchair for free. If I had to tell you that, oh my god, that's really messed up. She should know that by now, being, what, almost 40? Like, like last time I went to the hospital, they actually uh, used a wheelchair on me I because I, I can't up? walk very well. So, like, I, I think a wheelchair would be very, I, I'd be able to go out and do stuff if I had a wheelchair. I'd feel a little bit more independent, so I feel, I feel you there with a wheelchair. Um, oh, I want one so bad. Cause my knees, they don't, they don't, my knees are so bad now. They don't even like, I have to bend them for me. Like I have to move my legs to get them to bend. Yeah. Um, <laughs> it's bad. It's bad. My knees are so stiff now. Yeah. When you walk, it's like cotton. It's like cotton. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet about your kitty. Mine is laying on my bed, my bad knee purr and trying to heal it. It won't work, but he does it anyway. What a sweetie pie. <gasps> Dark Iver. How are you, sweetheart? Are you feeling better? Are you feeling better, honey? Oh my God, you had a bad day yesterday. Yeah, and I think she did that the other day when she peed and then she came back and it looked like she had the shower curtain on. 
Um, hey, Snark, I'm just going to give you a Streamlabs uh, link, and then you can use that uh, for your PayPal. To uh, PayPal works through there. I love you. I don't want anything bad to happen to you, okay? You're loved. You're loved. Just remember that. You're loved. You can wear your hooker heels. <laughs> I have I have sworn off heels since 27. I used to wear heels all the time. I know I'm, I'm tall, you would break I used them. to wear heels all the time, <laughs> but my ankle with the arthritis always like went on the side and I'd always like sprain my ankles with heels. Always had weak ankles. Always. We need to talk on, we need to talk. I, I, I got to figure out a time to do it. Oh, you too? You're fighting with your girl? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Those are, those are rough nights when you're fighting with your, your uh, significant other. Those are rough nights. I, you've seen us do it. But now that we have a good, like, medication going on. Right. It's <laughs> not happening as much. Which is good. I don't know if you're saying medicated properly. Well, I, I am. Mm. I feel I feel right as rain. Uh, it doesn't matter in a wheelchair. No, it doesn't. You can wear heels and I, I don't in a wheelchair, I guess. Free. But see, I don't I don't know. I still wouldn't wear them. <laughs> I don't know why women should use their feet in those things. Oh, so you're going through a depression moment and she's just, she's done with it. Well, I can't ask what's making you depressed because it doesn't have to be anything to be depressed. It's just how it is. Uh, I'm not going to give you advice because in all honesty, when it comes to depression, advice doesn't fucking work. It's, it's, it's like you have to pull your own, own self out of it. There you go, Snark. Um, I suggest start doing things. I know I wasn't gonna give you advice, but like what helps me is focus in on things that make me happy and, and positive yeah. and, and try not to talk to anyone or. Well, if anyone is ever in Shani's chat, just do this one thing. Ask her, what's the name of her rheumatologist? If she really has fibromyalgia, uh, only a rheumatologist can diagnose that and give that to her. And that's it. You ask her the name of her rheumatologist. She doesn't. She won't know what you're talking about. And then there you go. Like she self-diagnosed that. She doesn't have fibro. Or, you know, anything that is toxic, you know, just, just try to make yourself as happy as you possibly can. That's what usually helps me pull myself out of depression. Sometimes, though, I'm so depressed I can't even pull hey, myself out of depression. Matters. It's just I have to just go through it. You know, and that's some things with depression. Sometimes you just have to go through it. And just... <laughs> I'm so sorry. Depression sucks and... I'm sure everyone here can relate to it, Dark. I, I'm sure everyone. Oh yeah, she loves the liquid drag. <laughs> I'd be afraid I'd fall as soon as I tried to get out of the chair for anything. My ankles and knees are shite. Same. Yeah, depression sucks. I've been kicked out of religious group being fried twice in one day. That all in three weeks. Oh my god. Why are you being so attacked, dude? Like, you don't do anything. You're a nice guy. You're a sweetie pie. Well, yeah, my because as soon as she stops walking, she'll never walk again. You know, like, that'll, that's going to be it. So, yeah, they probably want her to walk as, as much as possible to not get to that point where, you know, where she gets bed sores and stuff like that, which she probably already has. Fuck me, dude. No. See, no this is thanks. why I don't deal with fucking religion. Everyone who has like their own religion, what? like spiritual You're people, are for Christ. It. But religious people, <laughs> judgmental <laughs> douchebags, and it doesn't matter what religion it is, they're all judgmental douchebags. If you aren't doing it like them, you're not part of us. Well, fuck you. I'm so sorry about that, Dark Iver. Yes, big hug to your grandson, Carrie. <laughs> Thank you, Peggy, for the prayers for him. He needs prayers. Depression is the worst. Sometimes you can't even get out of bed and no one understands why. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And they call you lazy and stuff. And it's like, I'm not lazy. I just can't. She, I think she thinks everyone is stupid, you know? Like, that's what it comes down to. Like, as right, you're saying right here, Penny. Like, we know, like, what, you know, the procedure is. But she's like, the way she explains it, it's like, that's not how these things are, get, are done. Focus on getting shit done. Yes. You got it, Nora. 
because I called them out for appropriating black culture, and also they were being performative over the road. Hey, Kelly, what's Wade. up? Ah, so they were just making money off that shit, and Carrie, what's up? I'm sorry. How you doing? Hey, remember, Carrie, when uh, whenever you're ready for uh, a little like interview, a little just a little just a little background, you just let me know. I am gonna deeply deeply appreciate it because um you know i really want to know what else went down i mean you know i can also ask anything like personal just the just the facts of what you already said i'm sorry is it is it the paganism group that you were in because i yeah. have i have no noticed oh you got the matrix on again on this tv i've noticed that um there's a lot of uh God especially on TikTok, there's like a lot of uh I, I guess you could say black culture like spiritualism going on and i'm noticing Watch it, some like white people picking it up too and it's like sounds like a dog whistle you, you, you do know we have our own ways of like doing magic right us white people right we don't have yeah. to steal it from blacks you know there's i don't i don't know overnight they female activists and they're hating on men right now yeah it's it's Okay, what's going on is, um... Well, I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, if she would shower once in a while, all those braids, like, doesn't the water, they take them out automatically? Like, she wouldn't have them in there for days on end. And this, that sweater, this champion sweater, this army one, is so dirty. I don't think they've ever washed it. She wears that thing every single day. The Divine Feminine is really taking place right now because of Roe versus Wade, and... Hey, Pew Pew, They up? really are put an initiative on the divine feminine and protecting of the divine feminine and i'm sorry you as a male have to go through that but that's that's what i'm noticing with the pegans right now um especially the female kind right i gotta get ready for work all right that's yeah, okay something Josh, you don't i forgive do. you <laughs> white youth keep keep a pet as tupac as their new rally cry wow well, you don't want to be part of that group anyway if they're going to act like that, you know? I, I, not all men are evil because of Roe versus Wade, ladies. Some are allies. And Nora, we all know here at the crib that she did not do it with malicious intent. She did it to protect those children, and that's it. That's all there is to it. Shani wants to spin it into a different narrative, but we know that Carrie's not manipulative. She did it for the sake of those kids because why should they be around their abuser? Why should she get away with And they it? believe that we should have our reproductive rights to our own fucking bodies. I hate that. I hate that. I hate they took away our rights to our own bodies. <laughs> because, see, that's that, like, even though it involves stank. the female right now, it's eventually going to involve the male, and then they're going to, like, put panels on who can have children or not and shit like that. What the hell is she talking about? Like, that's fucked up. Like, you're, you're too... It's eugenics. I think that's what it is. It's eugenics. Coming in fruition. I call them out. Tell it not meant for said use. Yeah. I agree with you over that. I think some people, they take their activism to really extreme levels. I, I mean, I'm an activist. Always have been an activist. <laughs> right. On multiple issues. She's everything. But the extreme activists, I have a problem with because they put everyone in these boxes and they assume that everyone's the same and they're not. And it's like, you got to tell these people to chill. Well, hold on, let me get a better angle. Well, there's a couple of things, Penny, that we were just talking about just a bit ago. Uh, there's the moles here, the warts. And then there's, um, Snarky pointed this out to me. He, they said that there's, there's something up here. I don't know what this is. It looks like some sort of skin rash right on the top of her forehead, either from lack of showering or bad makeup or just, I don't know, hep. <laughs> But we were trying to dissect it's like what is this what is on top of her head yeah i know they're coming for the lgbt rights my son is horrified over that that's true peggy people don't like it when you tell it how it is i don't know why though it's like it's your reality oh, why go. are you in this cognitive dissonance snarky atheist has just donated ten dollars through super chat thank you so much snarky i appreciate it and you said sunglasses perpetually fall onto the video game controller's proud face. <laughs> Thank you so much, Snarky. I appreciate it. And 
Um, I'm glad that you're part of the crypt. We have fun. It's so what your reality is. You're going extreme. You're hurting people. Maybe you should stop. But they weren't activists up until this point, and because of trend on TikTok, they ran with it. It's performative in its nature oh. because they never spoke about this any time in the last year until now. Let me ask a, a, a poll. People go with where the money is, I guess. That's a sad reality with people. Yeah, exactly. They hate on you because you don't agree with them, but it's like... Can we can we agree to disagree eventually, you know, instead of like hating on people? I don't know. That's just how I am. Do I follow Blair White? No, I do not follow Blair White. I, I, I used to watch her videos. Um, but I haven't followed her in a long time, to tell you the truth. It's been a, it's been a minute since I've seen Blair. Yeah, I love her too. I think she's incredible. Send copy DVD, I may call it racist. Oh. Why don't you talk about this stuff on YouTube? And like start an activism channel on YouTube and then you could start making some money. You know? You got a great activist from the couch, yeah, right? It's like it's like uh, John Lennon, you know, bed activist. <laughs> I'm getting my GCS surgery ASAP because I'm worried they're gonna try to outlaw them. Lots of trans people are. No, you get you get that surgery ASAP. That's scabies. You, need to. <laughs> you know, it's for your own mental health. You know, and I don't think people look at the, I don't think people look at like trans people like that. Like it's like they need to have these surgeries in order to not want to die. They hate their bodies. And and you're telling people that hate their bodies that feel like they're in the wrong body to like the wrong body. Keep it and accept it for what it is and it's like but their minds are telling them, their soul is telling them, their spirit is telling them they're not the gender they were born as like oh, why do, why go. would you want to be so cruel to someone over that when it could be an easy easy surgery to fix it and they don't feel like they want to die anymore i like because they make up a bible verse that says that men have to be men and women have to be women and no poor dog that. deserves shanny <laughs> it's your body do what you will with it exactly yeah, and I agree with that, but uh, I just think that anything that comes out of her mouth, like Shane just doesn't understand life and, and all this stuff, what's going on. So I feel like anything that she says, it's just, she doesn't understand it. You know what I mean? Exactly. It's their body. And if they feel, if they know deep down they're the gender they were born as, it's just cruel to not allow them to Probably experience Nora. their life as the gender they assign themselves as. It's just cruel to me. In India. It's actually interested in, in, in hey, their Melissa. culture. They look at trans people as as special, and they love them. You know, um, I think also another culture that's very accepting of trans. Well, thank Thailand. you. But I don't know. <laughs> I'd rather have shower. compassion <laughs> and empathy. Unfortunately, for not. Than just be straight up cruel and tell them to just accept hey, themselves for what they were born as, even though they they can't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Yo, yeah, bro, be like, yeah, Shanny, we're, we're out of peanut butter. Accept themselves because it's in their mind. <laughs> Don't forget to water <laughs> Rev's head today. The hair will grow faster. <laughs> I love that she's yelling. Oh, laughing at okay, Dark Iver. <laughs> you are beautiful. All right, I'll give you a quick rundown of what happened. All right. Well oh. Okay. What's up? So, um, I, I agree with a video on TikTok regarding a, a black man said, I'm getting tired of these white women appropriating and had the song of Tupac keep your head up in the background. And there's not enough black faces right. associated with this sound. That was it. The group I am with is huge on TikTok, a pagan group, Norse pagans. And um, I was part of that group. Some of them has taken said sound and made little trend videos to it with their performative activism for said calls. And they saw it and got into their just be called away as a white fragility over <laughs> me making said video. I was well, told I mean. that the video was racist and what have you. They have since then been to my page, seeing if I made other videos talking shit about said group. Train I private all of my videos and ass. basically have disappeared off of TikTok. And that is the long gist of what happened. Said video is in your message box. You can take a look at it. But yeah. Do you think they're throwing hexes at you oh. right now? Because I've noticed when 
Well, then, Rebecca, then, same statement would go for those cats then, too, right? They, they probably wouldn't pay for the cat food, so that if they have no more no money, they're so broke and poor, how were they feeding those cats? When people start throwing hexes at me, I start getting really depressed. <laughs> you if might have is, to cancel if, that out. If that's the case, then they won't be dead, and it's pretty much that well working, so... Um, you gotta cancel know. it out. I don't know, but I'll get off your live, but that's basically what happened, but yeah, they're stalking my page. Currently, they're probably throwing hexes at you, dude. I'm telling you, you need to do something to cancel that out. Uh, self care, okay. self care uh, from hexes. I, I I know a couple people. I'll tell them to do the following, but um, they're stalking <laughs> my page. They I, I went to my page. They things got them, desperate have, enough. Yeah, been on my page, so. looking Eventually. at my profile. So I could even say anything, or I might wind up getting mass reported. I don't know. But what I do know is, is that basically, um, yeah. <laughs> That's and weird. You're 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 black, and they're what? Yeah, there are. I they sent video. There are a bunch of white women who decided that they were going to. Think, and even after me giving them an educated lesson on what the issue is with with the song, they still had issues with. It. And then the next day, they're all up in there talking about I'm need, we all need to work together right. to work with women. And it just became this performative action of like click. And this was in a Facebook group. Click a blue heart if you're for women. Everyone needs. And I'm like. Like, really? Like, this is your way of activism? Oh, and really quick, just in case uh, for the new people here that don't know, Shani did do an OnlyFans, and it was like $10 or $30, then it went down to like $10, then it went down to $5, and then she eventually put it for free on Pornhub, and nobody wanted to see it. So, and then she just stopped doing it because people were like, ew, what the hell is this? Why is your, why is that gray, you know? <laughs> And it was it was a it was a mess. And yeah, give me some more views and get me in the algorithm, guys. It wasn't even an algorithm. This was in a group, Facebook group. They oh, were this doing, Facebook group. Oh, okay. Yeah, they they were doing this amongst themselves. Yeah. Like it was like I don't even know. It was like a bunch of people who discovered a new trend and was trying to make sure everyone was okay with said trend. And if he wasn't with said trend, then you're automatically, I get, in their opinion, against women. So then they said that if I came back to the group, uh, that. 10 plus of them was going to leave, which was probably the 10 plus that was doing said trend and did not like Jeez being Christ. called out on said trend or what have you, because a black man said something about something that was being, uh -huh. um, um, oh, okay, Carrie. So she was, she was buying tuna fish for them and the cats are probably like, I don't know what's, what's, what's you and what's, what's to eat. Appropriate it. And because I had the audacity to not even say it, yeah, I guess but they to could agree with another person that it was. It was deemed to be racist, which they don't even understand what racist is in the first place. And it just devolved into lunacy. These people, before this all happened, never made a political post, never said anything about activism, nothing. It was hey, joking Grace, about whatever, up? life in general. Glad you can make it. it. Right? Now all of a sudden Roe versus Wade happens, and now they're overnight fe feminist activists. <laughs> and I'm like, I have literally put my life on the line. To make sure a woman wouldn't get attacked and by her stalker, Twitter, right? Yeah. I have literally yeah. advocated for for my mother-in-law, who was basically told that she shouldn't be alive because she was too old. I have literally turned jobs down, paying good money because <laughs> they supply cages to the border. Like I put my mouth where put my foot where my mouth is and did the marching orders accordingly. I chose things that was hard because uh, just because it's not easy. We don't do things because they're easy. We do it because they are hard. Quote from JFK. Like, I literally had sat up there and gave them a complete dissertation in full of the significance of sin. Oh, so she she was getting a, a child support? Because I didn't really know too much about that. I know that that guy, Doug, and I don't even know if they were married. I know that's just, that's just biological children. I didn't know too much about uh, a lot of that. I'm just surprised that he doesn't try to get his kids now that they're actually in foster care. He's another, like, you know, dad of the year. But, you know, you know, I mean, uh, misery loves company and, and you know, uh, people who are similar like to hang out together. That all that <laughs> of the music, why black people are offended by it, why it seems it's been appropriated and how it minuscules <laughs> and lessens the black experience as a whole and everything else. Thanks for the Look it with me about. The, 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 of what happened if it was reversed. And I told her the truth. We are told it's not that big of a deal. Shut up. Get over it. 
you know, deal and so forth. Well, I literally well, told her. Do you her, have problems with white people dancing to like black artists or, or is that not the problem <laughs> or is it the lyrics, <laughs> the particular Tupac song? The, the term that was describing the black experience for black women and his appreciation for said black women. The artist himself said that's that who he made it for. They took out a small section. I mean, really, this just sounds like, I don't know. I don't know if he's trying to troll her or what, because she, she doesn't know what he's saying. You know, that, that fit, fit the narrative for abortion rights and then pretty much threw the rest of it in the trash. And uh, so, okay, I see it now. So that thought that, has deeper levels to it. I'm not sure what no, song you're referring no, that's, to. That's not you, man. Keep your head up. I'm going to look at that. Actually, big child. Literally, literally without saying the album was literally called for my inward because I don't know how Instagram is. But literally <laughs> said, for my inward. It oh. literally says when Shani's involved, that's like a six. Some black or the berry, uh, black or the berry, uh, black or the roots. And just goes through the whole black experience through the 90s with the crack epidemic, cr talking about the effects of crack on mm -hmm. like talking about crack babies, the full night. It was a complete dissertation of the black experience in the inner ghettos of America, right? She has yeah. no he, idea he what he's talking said, about. There's interviews with him in the black school saying why he made a little black guy why he made a song about about us. Literally, she said us. Um, what? there's and yeah, like literally, there is documentation from the artist of clearly indicating that this was meant for black women. On top of that, the song was originally dedicated to Latisha Harris, who was a black girl that was 15 that got killed in LA Rice. It is so in your face. Yeah, I see that now. I get exp exp explaining the, the whole thing. And they just did, they just ignored it. So uh, we don't really know. I think it's at least between four and 600 pounds. It has to be like, she's got roles for days. And it was meant for all women. Just like how some people say, all right. I like how she just like, you know, stops the, uh, <laughs> just stops the video. Drugs, folks, don't use them. <laughs> okay, let's get to the next video. Thank you for everyone being here. Hope you like the stream and just have a nice chill Sunday night. But, uh, yeah, Shani never changes. <laughs> Look at that face. Don't you guys just love the hat? All right, let's get into this. And so he was about oh. seven pounds. Hey. That chin, right? I was thinking that. <laughs> Today at the Institute, I was constipated. Jesus Christ, Jason. I'm live and you're saying that. That's cool. It's, there's nothing wrong with what I said at all. I was constipated once. Oh, I'll stop, Shannon. I was eight months pregnant with William, right? Ugh. Fucking huge. You know, I, I remind people that William was almost a 10 pound baby. Wow, so she was bigger than she is now. <laughs> Can you imagine? No, I can't. So he was about seven pounds at eight months, right? So. I was freaking huge. I was drinking prune Still juice are. growing up because I could not stomach that stuff. It has such a high sugar count. And I had gestational diabetes. Wilford Brimley, God bless. And then <coughs> and then Douglas, he 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 thought it was a brilliant fucking idea. <laughs> Just a brilliant fucking idea, Douglas. Yeah. <laughs> he thought it was a brilliant idea. Hey, babe, you want to go to Golden Corral? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, folks. <laughs> That's my husband, everyone. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> That's, the best in history. That's his license picture. Nick Bolte. <laughs> he looks nuts. <laughs> what the hell is that? What I'm is... just gonna let everyone laugh. What is it? <laughs> what is it? Great Scott. Hey, a... Yeah, Great Scott. Exactly. <laughs> Great Scott. That was a good one. I never. That's, that's, that's Lloyd Christopher Lloyd. Thank you, man. So G Man got me this. Love the hat. Jason's got one too. It's that color. Your color is so cool, man. It's like navy blue yeah. and black leather. Yours is awesome. I, I like this one, though. I look like an old person. Perfect. I'll wear this When she can reach the toilet. Yeah, I'm wearing this. Every For day. he is my king. <laughs> he is my king. 
How are you doing, bitches? What's up? <laughs> G-Man has has gifted me things today. Yeah, he talks. Well, where, where is it? There it is. Like, this beautiful moon buzz. As you can see right there, moon buzz. Delta 8 in Pineapple Express. Yeah, that's exactly what you need, right? Or not Pineapple <laughs> Express. I'm sorry. I, I, I fucking... Tommy Tron, forgive me. Maui Wowie, man. So, I'm partaking in some Maui Wowie right now. And it's delicious. And it gives you a really good body high. I feel like I'm floating. Merit. And, and, merit badges. And, and that's what truly matters is that I'm floating and I look like I've lost so much fucking weight in my fucking face and body. Wow. Wow. Really? That's what you think? You, you must be, you must be floating. Holy shit. I'm melting. I'm melting. What a world. What a world. <laughs> or cancer's eating me up. Right? It's like when the old people show up. <laughs> Still waiting on that. Kitty tits. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> that is a yeah I I'm telling you when she does this uh -huh. doesn't she look like Robert De Niro when she makes this face like seriously <laughs> that is a good screen name man kitty tits kitty tits <laughs> I have nipples Greg can you melt me Zap, go Joe well right Monty it's like if he did that for a troll or to lean into it, I don't know if that's the way to lean into it. How are you, my folks? My peeps? She's got a big <laughs> butt. That's me, it is, man. I'm just, like, admiring your name, bros. <laughs> Can you hand me a Coke? I. How about a Diet Coke? I love my <laughs> kitties. I love my kitties. Kitties. Hi, watermelon. Speaking of which, I said kitty, and she's like, "Hey, watermelon." She's like, "Get me out of here, <laughs> yeah. Tommy Chan." Yeah, you you heard that right. <laughs> oh, well, hello, watermelon. <laughs> Poor You're Tommy. Cute. Yeah, yes. Yeah. You're a good girl. You, you want food? Okay. All right. <laughs> I'll give you food. Right. Yeah. <laughs> that whatever is that's in front of her face is is rubbing up against the hat. Wow, she's really. Strong. Love you, Gojo. She yeah. is. She's starting to talk sure, to us. Yeah. She's starting to talk to us, Watermelon. It's cool. She's a good girl. You have 13 <laughs> right? cats? That's amazing. That's awesome. Squizzle Wizzle. Wizzle. Unicorns and bacon. That's a good one. Unicorns and bacon? Unicorns and bacon. It's a unicorn with wings made of bacon. Kevin Bacon. <laughs> I have four black cats. What's watermelon eating? Uh, yeah. Meow mix. Meow mix, original. Meow mix, meow mix, please, please deliver. deliver. That's right. Very good. Hello, Desert Oasis vibe. And isn't Delta 8 like a lot lighter? Or like it's not as strong as a um, normal pot? Oh, God. It's on the low really level, nice. right? Some Desert Oasis vibes. You know? You see it. I know, Tara, you know, I mean, like, really, trigger warning for anyone who has family that has cancer, um, including myself, it, it definitely bothers me, too, you know, um, because it's like, man, you are, you're so low that you're going to now say you have that, too. I mean, she literally has everything in the book. She has diabetes. She has cancer. She has fibro. She has uh, Epstein-Barr. She has all these things, but then she never goes to a doctor. A cute little, like, lizard crossing. I currently have nine newborn kittens, 11 adults. Wow. <laughs> they all adopted me. I have 25 pound ginger cat. That's beautiful. You run a rescue. Oh, I love that. Thanks, no cats here. Although I love them, just horses. I love horses. Me too. I love them. They are majestic animals. But to tell you the truth, I, I, I tend to be a very eclectic type yeah. of person. And I think I like donkey's personality a little bit more than a horse's. Like, a ho horse is you know what's in it. noble, but a donkey can, like, get fucking down and fucking just make you laugh. Like, they have, like, a greatness of humor. 
That's one thing I love about donkeys is their sense of humor. Is she really talking about donkeys right now? And what, what was she saying? That she wants to do a, a donkey show? <laughs> what is this? Love you too, Desert. I've never tried it. Meow, 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 meow. Deliver it. Donkeys and mules are very awesome animals, too. Yeah. You're afraid of horses. Nah. There's nothing to be afraid of with them. Yeah, Carrie. They're pretty domesticated. Just don't cross its boundaries. It'll let you know. Animals yeah. have their ways of letting you know what boundaries. Yeah, the the animal get all slappy with you, right, Shani? They have. <laughs> they let you know. And you oh, hey, Patty. Them. Like, like you were. Uh, some Instagram videos. The recent ones. The, this one's from today. Back to person. What's up? And and no harm, no foul. You Thanks know for I mean? coming. Oh my God! Did they find Gavin? What? Oh my God! They may have found Gavin. <laughs> Holy crap! That's big news. Oh, we need to watch Trippy. Yeah, <laughs> dude. I mean, was guys, was there another video that actually when Gavin escaped? Because <laughs> I didn't get to see that one. I know if Gavin was there, now this one, I guess Gavin's gone. They found Gavin. Gavin escaped. Oh my God, Darth heard the last video. The you know, Gavin's like, he kept hearing run, Rev, run. And Gavin's like, well, Rev, if you're not going to run, I'm, I'm going. He wants Veckel to stop talking to me. Veckel, I have a bone to pick with you. Oh Show my me. God, no. This is horrible. Veckel and Darth Darkens fighting each other. Well, we're non-Christians according to Veckel. I don't Gavin know. was missing. Yeah, in Red Dead Redemption 2. Okay, this is why I actually got <laughs> Gavin from the Pet Smart, yeah, okay? Yeah, there is a guy in Red Dead Redemption yeah. 2 named Gavin that this guy is searching for. He's searching. Uh, Kristen, they get all these uh, videos. For Gavin, right? So I go to the PetSmart looking for a cat. Like, yeah, I'm going to get myself a cat. And and there's, <laughs> there's, there's Gavin. There's the name. Gavin. I found Gavin. Wow. Holy shit. I found Gavin because it was right when Red Dead started right when they when it was first released so basically <laughs> because of that game i got gavin and he's the best cat ever he is really so she's just pretending See, i found gavin <laughs> <laughs> and i also i also like gave the video to trippy <laughs> and he he yeah. he hearted it he, hard he it. loves me yeah, he that's right trippy bigger can. youtubers know me yeah. Because I'm the shit, man. <laughs> I'm no, I'm no like, low-class YouTuber, man. I'm high-class YouTuber. Yeah, we're, you're like a high-class YouTuber here. And you see those? These are high-class warts, okay, folks? These are high-class warts. I just can't <laughs> seem to stay on the freaking platform because these trolls won't let me. So I'm like, fuck that. I'll just stay on Instagram, and I'll stay on freaking Twitch, and I'll just say, fuck you, YouTube. You never protected me. Oh God. Maybe uh, YouTube has to protect uh, us from you. You ever think of that? Lawyer. They are very abusive, and they ha and I have grounds to sue them. Yep. No, she Most would kill that do. donkey. So sweet. Gavin came home from his awesome namesake. Yeah. How am I feeling, dude? I am feeling like shit today. I've been I've been dealing with that fucking hay curious. fever. Everyone's curious. mowing their grass, so my eyes are all fucking itchy. My my nose has been like severely. It's better now since it's nighttime. Yeah. But my nose has been dripping. My my throat is all fucking sore. You were like, laid out today. I was, and I was sleeping. Yeah. I loved my YouTube too. There was no reason to get it taken down. None. Oh, no. She hasn't even changed the sheets. Jesus, Whatever. Man, evade these nuts, man. <laughs> She's so high. Man, evade these nuts. I don't care about you you little people hey, Joe, who want to stay up, bro? in your negative energy. That's okay. You can catch the live. I got there. bigger fish to fry. What's up? Do you have any honey? Sometimes local honey can help hay fever. And I, I mean, 
the thing is, I really think that Shani is as much involved in that what happened to those kids as Rev is. I will not think otherwise until I see uh, some different proof because just the way everything went down and when Rev came back saying that the, the cops were asking him questions and he was like, I don't know, he was kind of implying that there's more to this and that Shani has more to do with this than we actually know. Asthma. We should get some local honey, man. We should go to the farmer's market and get some honey from the farmer's market. Definitely. I don't even know if they're happening anymore, hon. I really don't think they are. I haven't seen cars over there. COVID has killed everything. It has. Your hair looks amazing. It's so hot. Thank you. Super no, it's hot. not. I enjoy <laughs> having braids in my hair. I like embracing yeah, right. my Celtic slash That's native side. really hot. I love it. Yeah, I know I'll feel better. It, it, it's just this year is particularly worse on the pollen. You know, they were talking about this like super pollen. There's not as many bees anymore. This is my theory, okay? There's not many bees anymore. So, and the flowers aren't getting as pollinated as they used to be, right? I mean, I've never seen a quote unquote mother try less to try to get the, her children back you know like she hasn't tried anything job <laughs> what's a job she she doesn't even get paid for doing these instagrams and her other i think maybe she's yeah she's monetized on twitch but she don't get a lot if she's not doing drama when she's doing her games no one watches so it's like she's not getting enough to act like this <laughs> She so, she has a face like, in her face. the honeybees on the endangered species list now. Did you know that? So there's not a lot of bees now. So, Same here. I think what's going on is the flowers of the vegetables or whatever is growing. I think they're exerting an overabundance of pollen because they're not being pollinated. And they're <laughs> desperate to, like, breed. It's an overload. Oh, he does. Oh, you're gonna color your hair? What color are you coloring it? I need to, I need to re-up mine, my color. I have it somewhere around yeah, my- Yeah, it's just, it's just awful, Carrie, you know? Fucking organized chaos. Yeah, that's what I call it, organized chaos. Cause it's all in an organized place. It's just chaotically spread it around. Such a slob. Yeah. And I'm at the point in my life where I just don't care. Purple, love it. I wish I could send desert air to you. We're so clear, and our allergies are over so far. I don't, I don't know. She's trying to say, Carrie, that she, you know, people are mowing lawns, and since she doesn't mow lawns or do anything, it's shaking around their pollen and her dust around her, and it's making her sneeze. And now she's talking about YouTube, and they didn't protect her, and something about warts <laughs> i think you're right my family in oregon is just suffering <laughs> an air purifier y yeah that could that could that could help but it's the pollen dude like i i was like i was live streaming had my contacts in my eyes were like watering and just itchy so bad that i was like i don't even want to have my con yeah i well i noticed from what you guys are saying she's barely inhaling it right just like she just barely inhales the vape she doesn't know how to do anything she can't even she can't even do drugs right tax in so i'm kind of <laughs> like blind at the moment and i just don't nope. care i pretty much cried all make all the makeup i had on today And I had a pretty cool look today, man. I was like going with like this purple fairy like. Let me see actually look. how she sounds. I think I pulled it off. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I just like her because I did try to help her a long time ago before I knew any of this stuff, like three years ago or two years ago, something like that. And she does remind me of people that would, you know, would be like the really, really big obese what's eating gilbert grape woman in, you know in town that like abused her kids and threw stuff at them and people could drink at her house stuff like that and that's what makes she makes me think of every time i see her 
how has your day been, you and Jason, feeling good? Uh, other than the hay fever, it's been fine. I look good in pink and purple. I've done the, I would love to do just pink and purple, like pink and purple streaks. Yeah, that's all right. I mean, you had a Picasso on your head. I did have a Picasso. That was absolutely. I should, I, I want to get a bunch yeah. of different colored hair dyes and just like. Yeah. Yeah. Go, go crazy. Like, seriously, anybody else who just dealt with what she dealt with these past couple of weeks, they'd be like so upset you know you they wouldn't be able to make videos like this you know what i mean like she they would be like um i don't know i think i need time i need to fix myself not just get high on on a synthetic pot and then make dumb videos that was amazing work what he did but this would be even more amazing yeah yeah because <laughs> uh, you would actually jackson pollock the shit just blah 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 right sick Huh, how original, Rev. Yeah, man. The pollen's bad this year. <laughs> yeah, yeah, even sucks. even you're you're having problems too. Yeah, I had allergies. You see it in your eyes. Yeah. No, you do you're you're high. You stop it. <laughs> you're you're both high. Area. Wow. Yeah. He, he's Hay so fever, pale. Big time. I used to have it bad when I was like eight <laughs> seven, eight years old. I, I had it pretty bad. Eyebrows are coming back. Uh, it went away, but this year, holy shit, I feel like a kid again. <laughs> Not in a good way. No. Like, it's bad. It's bad. It's bad. Hey, I, why do they have that green screen behind them? They never, ever, ever, ever use it. I haven't had hay fever since I was like 10. Like, seriously. I haven't had hay fever since I was like 14. There you go. It's bad. Well, no, 19. 19 that one time okay my dad i was mowing the grass oh that yeah um, that's that's extreme i know they used you were to mowing the grass yeah that's, you're gonna trigger an attack if you've ever had it yeah yeah i well what makes me not believe it so much joey is because the fact that they keep on referencing it anytime these two just go and over and over and over about something it's there's more to it warren dad every time i conditioned myself against it because i was doing the lawn when mom was looking. I warned dad. I said, dad, you know me. I'll mow the grass, but you know me. You hit the dad, dad. He never listens to me. Well, you know, I get that, Brett, and I, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> you know, I mean, people, certain people, even that we care about, you know, they'll, they'll have their their ways you know i've had family members that i particularly didn't get along with because of bullshit but <laughs> it really makes you think and yeah you get reminders when you see people like this that don't do anything to help their children nobody ever listens to me it's dust and then what i say always happens it always happens I mean, seriously, she knows that if she never made these videos, no one would know what's going on. Nothing could, she wouldn't be reported. But then at the same time, it's a good thing because those kids would have nobody to help to help them, you know, because we'd no one have any idea that she's just sitting there getting high while they're sitting there starving. Some people, it's going to be very bad for you guys. I'll be honest, because you, you stored up some really bad karma fucking with me oh i'm so afraid like i'll just be honest you shouldn't have really touched me all you people that touched me oh yeah definitely jelly but you didn't see that video when she beat him up they went to a movie theater and they were both drunk and they drove home drunk with the kids and they got into this big old fight and she she uh hit him you know, with the, with the, apparently a fetish whip, but it, there was bruises all over his face and his arms. Like she beat him bad, and it was like the same thing. She would she she went she went to jail. She didn't have no underwear on. Yeah, I, I gotta do that video. <laughs> I gotta show that video again. That video is a classic. But uh, yeah, he, he's definitely afraid of her. 
without a doubt. So bad, man. Because I, I'm with a very patient God. Okay. I'm, I, I'm with a God who, who's very loving and forgiving and merciful, but the Avenger of all Avengers. Like, he's going to kick your ass. My God is going to kick your ass. And don't say I didn't warn you. Well, uh, well, you know, Nora, you know, we'll see as time goes on, but I'm pretty sure that after 30 days, she's still not going to have those kids. I warned. And I warned and I warned and I warned. Please leave me alone. Please be better. They never get better. She could do something. They only too. wax worse and worse. Jesus <laughs> prophesized that, by the way. Oh, you know what, guys? I want to tell you something funny. Some shanty uh, simp uh, commented on one of my videos recently, and they were like, "Shut up, Drave. You don't know her. She's trying the best she can. Why don't you leave her alone?" Blah, 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 blah. And I will, you know, I got rid of it. But uh, before that, I told her like, she shouldn't be. First of all, she's going to ch um, after Shani whatever yells at her or does something that's so gross that she's going to have to leave. She's going to be come back and be like, "Oh, I'm so sorry," because everybody does. And secondly, like I know this person, she has never changed. This is the same narrative that the whole three years I've been watching her. She pretends to be someone different. People realize it, they move on, and then they start watching her like this, and then she does it over again, and it's it's a never-ending cycle. But I just thought that was funny. I wanted to share that with you guys. It's even to this day, people are still simping, simping for her, thinking that, oh, she's not bad. She's doing her best. Like, really, if, if this looks like a mother doing her best, trying to get her children back from CPS, then I, I don't know what to tell you. Ridiculous. Like... I remember a time where these same people that fuck with me. I remember a time where these people would denounce anyone who would do anything close to what they've done to me. I remember that time. I remember that time where they respected people's boundaries. Yeah. <laughs> I remember that time, you know? I remember that time. They changed. They got so bad. You know? And I figure it's it's hey, the separation between the wheat and tares. You can tell. Uh, well, Shani's all high on her Delta 8 that she got from G-Man. That enabler. And uh, she's wearing G-Man's hat. Getting it all her whatever. Her rash. Her forehead rash. I don't know if you noticed that. She's just got this nasty forehead rash. She's rubbing up against the her, the hat, and uh, I guess Gavin escaped, and that's pretty much it. <laughs> Tell the difference between Thanks the wheat for being and tears. Here. The wheat is very loving and nourishing, while the tears just take up all yeah. the nutrients for it's themselves nasty. from the wheat, and pretty much steal from the wheat. Oh, thanks, Amanda. Welcome to the crypt. But we have fun. you know what? For some reason, Jesus said, let the wheat and tares grow together. <laughs> you know, but there's going to be a time where there's a harvest. She does, Joey. And they are, they, they're nuts because they, they try to protect her. And they're like, yo, man, we're going to expose you. You better leave our shanty alone. And they're like, expose me. I have a pretty boring life, <laughs> you know, other than doing stuff like this. Like, it's just like, it's so stupid. And then, like a like weeks later, once they do something that Shane does something that pisses them off, or she does something nasty, then they'll come back and be like, "Yo, I'm sorry. I was just trying to help that woman." It happens all the time. Great. So I don't take it personal. And the wheat and the tears I just think it's funny. are actually no, going to be separated, 100%. and the tears are going to be, you know, right? So we got to do something about it. Because that's what you should do with tears, is you burn them, because why? 
why continue the imposters, you know? Or you could say how Jesus talked about sheeps and wolves clothing, waiting for anyone <laughs> to devour. The people who fuck with you now have fallen. I think we all could truly support our brothers and sisters. We don't always have to agree just to be the best we can be. Yeah, exactly. But the problem is, Shani doesn't take accountability for anything. You tell any of the, you know, I won't call them Sims followers, the people who want to help her, like, like Shani's a big fat project. You tell them, hey, if she can't take accountability for anything, nothing at all. I mean, come on, we're not 100% right in the world on, on things. You know, there's some things, you know, I feel like when fights happen, they're at least 50 50. If you don't take accountability, accountability for anything, then I can't listen to you. And she never does. What did you guys eat for dinner? Mm. I haven't had dinner yet. I'll be honest. I don't have much of an appetite lately. Um, I drink mostly sugar-free stuff. Hey, Sandra. Uh, what's up? Thanks for coming. But I don't have much of an appetite. That also freaked the doctor out. <laughs> the fact that I don't have much of an appetite. I freaked my doctor out so bad. Like, hey, I've only been there for two visits and I'm already freaking you out. Woo! That, that... Oh, hey, what's up, holy hell? Thank you. Welcome to the crib. Yeah, and I get you, Carrie. Just like, just like how I was. It's like trying to make sure those kids are okay. Or and she was alone besides when Red was in jail. Yeah. With no one to wipe her butt. <laughs> some shantyism right, right there. I hear you. Yeah. That's some shantyism. Already freaking my doctor out. Didn't take long. I freak a lot of people out. Well, I think prior to everything, when she had children there still, they were trying to help her for the sake of the kids. Because they're like, oh my God, you take care of children? But you're like, you make like eight hour streams and 10 hour video game streams. When do you have time to feed them or clothe them or take care of them? And it's just like that you realize like, oh, she really needs a lot of help. Maybe I could just help her out. Be like, give her reminders and stuff. But no, it's, it never works out. <laughs> I love you, <laughs> Becky. Yeah. I hope I'm well too. I hope it's just nothing that's going on with me. I'm just losing weight. You know, I told Jason this is usually yeah. the time where women in my family lose weight. Like they're heavy <laughs> in like their mid 20s to 30s and then they start losing weight around. I'm pretty caught up, but can you give me a quick rundown on who who carries? Oh, well, Carrie was just like another person watching, uh, try to help Shani for the sake of her ch two children that she did have there. And um, Rev allegedly went after the uh, the autistic child and and kicked him in the in the in the uh, ribs, right, or in the side. And the police were called a couple days later. He, he went to jail and he was supposed to stay away, but he went back and she told Carrie all about it. And then she got mad because Carrie was like, I need to tell people like that's those kids are not going to want to, you know, be there with, with their abuser just hanging out. And as soon as they, as soon as uh, Rev came back, they had sex. So there's that too. Around their forties. But welcome. <laughs> um, I made homemade cinnamon rolls today. Wow. Why do they steal all, all my videos? Because they try to trigger me. They try to trigger me. Thank you, Becky. You're so sweet. Homemade cinnamon rolls. Oh, God. I've made homemade cinnamon rolls before out of Bisquick. And I took some margarine that country crock shit and um, put cinnamon sugar and rolled it up 
and then made some icing out of like milk and um <laughs> powdered she she thinks she's losing weight sandra sugar that was some damn good shit i made peanut butter chocolate fudge oh you oh 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 now i lived most of my life in the south you know how much i love fudge mm. god you find these like oh <laughs> this is why i love the south so much you find these like little tiny like country mom oh thanks for being shops, here saint right and they always have, have a good the, night. like homemade fudge I, I especially enjoy the rocky road because the marshmallows on homemade fudge are so delicious. That reminded me, we have those talentes. I would love to have a little bit of something. Oh my god, can you get me the... Which one do you want? The layered one. The, la the layered one. The caramel. Whatever it is. The caramel one. <laughs> Whatever it is. <laughs> exactly. You're a pastry chef. That's beautiful. I love that. I love that. Oh, yeah, like sure. all those, like I, I, like, I love to cook. <laughs> I love to cook. I miss cooking. I hate what I hate what I have. I hate what I have. I hate this illness. Whatever it is, I don't know what it is yet. I'm oh, trying to figure voice. it out. <laughs> hey, Mister Unite. But unfortunately, it takes like since COVID, it's like takes forever to get appointments. Like I got appointment next week, so. Oh, sure it's work. <laughs> yeah. That looks amazing. Look at this. Salted caramel truffle. Yeah, I'll tell you because I've had that ice cream before. Not that exact one, but like that brand. Those gelatos is like over like 2,000 calories just in that small little thing. And I'm sure she just, you know, she'll just devour this whole thing in one sitting. Holy shit. And it's got a hair stuck to it. Ew. <laughs> Prowling mine or Gavin's or Gavin's something. Ew. Look at the layers and that shit. Oh my <laughs> god. Oh. Yeah, red the rhinos. My Think of the god. rhinos. Look at the, look at the big chocolate chunks. Holy crap. This looks so fucking good. <laughs> she's telling you she's gonna eat that. I, I think I'm gonna thoroughly enjoy this salted caramel truffle. Bourbon fudge brownie. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Talenti shit I got you. is so good. Oh yeah. That's really smooth. Oh yeah. Yeah, and that's right, Nora. Uh, the children were crying. They didn't want the guy back, so it wasn't just us allegedly thinking this this was a hundred percent the truth mm. that'll make my throat trip feel <laughs> yeah. so much better over ice cream or gelato my throat has been so bad i fucking hate hay fever i hate it i hate it i hate it because i was like i'm gonna live stream all day nope my body was like, no, girl, you're going to have some Benadryl and you're going to be sleeping today. And I'm like, okay. All right. Yeah. How, yeah. How would she do that, Mr. Unite? Yeah. Yeah. Don't they have like something's wrong with the oven? Um, I mean, they must have at least power for those fans. But yeah. And uh, didn't they have no running water for a while? Do they even have running water still? Or, I, I don't know. I, I know they didn't. Was that G-Man? <laughs> the way they live, folks. Okay. <laughs> that one. Door He was trying so hard to make me laugh. Yeah. This is game. Yeah. 
he loves you. I know. He's right? So... For people that don't have a pot to piss in, they, they, they buy the expensive ass gelato. So cute. He loves you. He does love me. I love ice cream. I do not care for chocolate that much, though. Oh. I, I, I love chocolate. Yeah, it does taste, take patience, Patty. <laughs> I just like dessert, period. Like it's gelato, it's not ice cream, and it's so. Do you know the difference between ice cream and gelato? I should, but I don't. Egg yolk. <laughs> That's it? Yep. What's up, Amazing. six drops? It's been a bit. How you doing? The egg yolk makes it creamy. God, this one for you. You're cool. What? My, <laughs> you rich. My culinary knowledge. Because I'm sure I heard that. But she ain't thought she was bougie you last year. You were two years it. ago. That's amazing. Oh, I, I, I like I, I'm a chef because of freaking how much I consumed Food Network. Me too. I like I'm near that, but you're fucking amazing. Just remember everything. Yeah. Hey. Everything. I'm a visual learner. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. Yeah. I'm a lot like that. Too. You know, I, like, I'm not much of a reader. Well, well, I am a reader, but, I mean, I don't learn that much from reading. Yeah. I learn more from... Action, yeah. I mean, I learn from reading, don't get me wrong. I know. But I learn better, that's the better word. Yeah. I learn better from visual. Yeah, I understand. Me too. I'm a lot like that. Like, I learned how to crochet just by visual. Right. Just okay. watching YouTube videos. Mm -hmm. I got it. Yeah, all my mom knew how to do was just, just chain. Basic. Just, no, not even basic, just chain. Oh, she good. didn't even know how to do a single crochet or a double crochet. Wow. She just knew how to just do a chain. That's so easy. You self-taught everything that that amazing shit you do. It can't be yeah, ripped released that bull crap. Taught. That's amazing. That's amazing. Because you make beautiful things. Oh, that's bull. Aw, oh, you <laughs> sexy bitch. I'm making fried eggs. Hmm. Listen to this. Ham steaks, grits, fried green tomatoes for breakfast oh, tomorrow. Oh, God. Can we come over? Yeah, can I come over? I'll eat your shit. Ew. <laughs> I love me some fucking fried green tomatoes. They are just the best motherfucking things in the oh, whole entire ahead. world. Salted. Oh. I love... Is that what's happening? The thing to a fried green tomato is a fried pickle. Yeah, oh, I thanks. Agree. I really haven't used it. But there's something about a fried green tomato, you know? Green tomatoes are... Oh whatever but when you do them that way oh my god no nah, there's nothing better than than having your own garden with zucchini and yellow squash and the green tomatoes yeah. and you and you fry up all of that shit yeah man oh definitely that's so good that's jamie oliver shit yeah even even like have an eggplant and fry that shit up. Yeah. Yes. I know. It's like, it's weird to think that your skin kind of will just, you know, stretch that far, but like the skeleton will stay the same size. <laughs> yeah. I know what you mean. Have a side of marinara with that. Yes. Dip that shit in. Yeah, that's great. It'll be good. <laughs> Did you watch Jamie Oliver a lot when he was on? I've watched him plenty. Yeah. yeah he was one of my favorites. Awesome. I honestly think one of my favorites was probably Rachel Ray. Yeah, I loved Rachel Ray. Everything she does. And Robin, you remember Robin? Um, yeah, because she's losing she so much weight. She was a mom with the two sons. Yeah, she's cool. I loved how she did her meal plans and yeah. Sandra. Sandra Lee. Yeah. Yep, Sandra Lee. She like I loved. I, I just. I absorbed all of it. Yeah, me too. And then, <laughs> and then there's the queen herself. I forgot. Paula. I know. Paula Dean. <laughs> hey, Anne. What's up? Oh my God! Give me some life in Paula Dean. Oh. That's right. Oh. I love Paula. 
My God, I want to try her macaroni and cheese at least once in my fucking life. You gotta get the lady and sons once. Yeah, we gotta go to Georgia. That's right. I know somebody. We gotta go to Savannah. Yeah, Savannah. Oh my God. I, I never actually visited Savannah. Wow, really? No, I I would have loved to. <laughs> I always drug. drove through it. <laughs> Yeah, that's uh, that's, I made my that's own G Man's cat. brownies and eating it with frozen vanilla custard. That is the Yum. shit, Shanna. Tomorrow Yum. for early dinner, I'm making homemade stuffed peppers. Ah, oh. ah, oh. I love <laughs> stuffed peppers. Me too. Yeah, she's an animal. <laughs> Are you default meat, meat or default rice? You want in my live? You want to talk to me, Dark Giver? Give me some sugar. My mom right. makes her mac and cheese. Hashtag bed I do too. Look up her recipe and do a cooking show with it. Oh. Her ooey gooey butter cake. Oh my, stop it. Stop. That eggnog, that thick ass eggnog she made that one year. You gain weight thinking about her food. It's like, okay. <laughs> the stick of butter she, is she worth gains the experience. Weight experience. It is. <laughs> it is. Actually. <laughs> Stick of butter in everything. Oh my god, it was just so fucking good. <sighs> That's rich as fuck, man. Sticks of butter in everything. One stick of butter. Always. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe 700 pounds. I like when you talk to others on here. You should interview people. I should, shouldn't I? You're I can. Good at that. Can you open this? Yeah. No, she don't. Because every time she talks to someone, she usually fights with them. I I cannot. Open Unless they kiss her big ass. <laughs> God, that was loose, honey. God bless you. I can't open shit anymore. Yeah, it might be MS. Yeah. Oh, oh God. Here we'll we go. find out. Yum. What's the thing? She don't know. Oh, this is the caramel, I guess. That's so luscious. Oh, right on those broken teeth. Mm. Right on those broken teeth. <gasps> Ooh, right on those broken teeth. <gasps> I know, I know. It's disgusting. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Go all the way through, you know. I know. You gotta get the layers. I just wanted to try the caramel. Mm -hmm. mm. I say nothing. This brand is amazing. <laughs> she's just that means she's lazy wow oh what happened to the noise <laughs> what's up my brother from another mother no, i'm much over listen to you pretty much have food porn discussions right mm. i am having yeah. a food porn session and i'm fine with that mm. yo she she's mostly gumming it <laughs> it's so good. Yeah, I just want to. CMS. <laughs> Lord. You heard it. How you doing? I'm, all, I'm doing all right. Uh, you're doing all right? That's good. I hope you're doing all right. Well, I just woke up. I might play some Mario Brothers in a bit. That's about yes. It. I have Mario Odyssey for my Switch. I do too. I do too. <laughs> so, do you have the network, um, network, the, uh, the online the, play? The, yeah, I do. We could play it together, dude. That what I was saying. Um, I need a friend now that I have my kids. I got a wireless headset so I could actually talk while playing. Oh, is, uh, is that who this is, Carrie? Because I, I I don't know who this this guy is, <laughs> but I've heard of him. <laughs> <Like Richard. laughs> That's great. That's fun. I miss drag. Right. I think I got I've got a little bit of money left, so I could probably pick up a membership for. Uh, 
Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, celebrity. For a while. So. Good to see you. Thanks for yeah, thanks for gonna... listening. I yeah. think the Nintendo Online is a good deal. It's... Uh, no, I think this is a guy that they call Liquid Drag, right? Yeah. So it's basically like Drag Not Light. <laughs> it's a Drag Not that Shannon can get along with. Twenty dollars a year. Well, I have like, I think I have enough money for it to pay for like one month. No, yeah, Joe, you know, G Man is a big, big old baby. He's awful. He, he talks like a child. He's very. He's a. Yeah, you'll know when it's G Man. <laughs> I might be able to get more once everyone starts yeah, working. Yes, definitely again. be safe, too, sir. Mm-hmm. And then next week on the 12th, I start back to school. Oh, uh, good. Doing my work. I got a week to basically do a bunch of work and two exams in order to pass their course because I had to take a leave of absence. I didn't either. Mm -hmm. I never seen the guy before. There's that. Hey, enjoy school though. I loved I loved going to school. Yeah, right, Holly. Uh, It's a mixed bag for me. I had to basically like memorize everything because I don't take notes well at all because well you see my writing is a combination of like trying to decipher the Dead Sea Scrolls yeah is this you bro that's great all right well then he's right here so uh (laughs) Dead Sea Scrolls (laughs) you're gonna get shitty crazy (laughs) (laughs) I remember the note taken yeah so. And then studying your notes, just going through it over and over again. Yeah. Well, imagine unable to take notes because you both can't understand them because you're dysgraphic and dyslexic, and you have to memorize everything. That's <laughs> oh, pretty, Lord. Yeah, that's pretty much what I'm going to be doing next week is uh, watching I'm videos. sorry. Oh, it is what it is. My GPA is actually pretty high so far in school. I just networking yeah oh i didn't know money was live um fb stuff um what fb stuff facebook my ass has been i've taken this course like twice she love going to school (laughs) (laughs) yeah she'd be she'd be into it jesus you damn right this is all I ate. <laughs> yo, yo, Shani, um, celebrity juicer, Shani has done stuff in front of Rev for ever since I've known her. She's talked to other women, other guys. This is a, not a new hat to her. She does this stuff all the time. Like, she don't give a shit about his feelings. He's already done with his. I'm done. That was amazing. Wow, <laughs> that's some talent. You could do a, a food eating contest. I don't know. The skinny ones they eat the quickest. <laughs> I know us fat people. We gotta. We gotta. You know, just enjoy that food. You know, <laughs> yeah. just savor it. I I go buy a donut. Shut my gate twenty pounds. I just walk and buy it. So you know. Oh. Krispy Kreme. Oh my god! Early in the morning. Oh. Yep. Mm-hmm. We got that smell. Oh. Have you heard they about have. Have you heard what? Of no. Oh, you should look them up. They literally have like a maple apple bar in the shape of a certain male object that they sell on a regular basis. Oh, I love that. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love that. I would eat that. Say, I'd eat that shit would. on camera. <laughs> I have no shame. Oh, God. No shit. You're killing me here. Yeah, um... Yeah, you ever come up to Oregon? You, you need to find voodoo death Oh, yeah, right? Miss Unite, didn't she say that uh, the, the, the principal tried to, uh, you know, be with her? And, you know, which obviously is a lie. <laughs> 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 oh, 
Oregon would be fun. All right. They were at homeschool. I have a weedcation there. Well, they definitely <laughs> got between that, the food trucks that we have down here in Plentiful and everything else. We also have the strip club capital for Vegas. <laughs> right. Six shops. And adult shops. That, that list is mm. lower. Yeah. Yeah. Of course, you got no shame. You saw the adult shop. You saw the rash, right? You have fun in those places. Yeah. I, no faith. I'd rather go to Florida, honey. Good point. I want to go to Florida to live. That's. Great. I want to go to Florida and have a papaya tree and a mango tree. Yeah. And every morning, I take a papaya and mango and eat it. And, and look at the lizards and the birds again. The, pro the problem with Florida is, first of all, once you hit the Florida state line, right, you basically enter Silent Hill. Because if you go through there at night, it's literally a wall of fog. On the main, on the main highway strip, you go Oh, through. I know. Yeah, so it's like entering Silent Hill. Driving through. Wow, really, Carrie? Uh, is that something she told you? He failed all his classes this semester, had to do summer school with a tutor because of it. Wow, so a tutor was going to their going to their place. Can you imagine a tutor coming in there like, whoa, that smell. What that what is that? That is that is foul. That is ripe. <laughs> Through 70. Right Three. there. Yeah, so um, completely uh, and, flat. Yeah, and considering how bad you don't have to worry the, uh, she can't even get to the bathroom florida is overall <laughs> yeah it is like entering silent hill because they 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 just don't make no sense <laughs> everyone's week. saying that and well she's like oh a g-man gave it to her it's g-man's and 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 rev's obviously wearing a hat too for obvious reasons but yeah it, it that rash probably did get worse That's <laughs> yeah no nah, i'm good i'll go visit but you can get me to live there we're actually planning to. T we could do that. We don't have the boys. No, no. Yeah. It's time to do it. Yeah. We could actually go to the actual Silent Hill. We're really close by it. Wow. Yeah. You have fun with that. You have fun. Yeah. yeah. Scary shit. Yeah. We <laughs> we definitely are gonna get that on tape. You have fun with that because um, let's see. Um, yeah, that's how y'all get killed. Y'all go to them. Oh, okay. And yeah, well, you know, like again, that's that's her fault. Did you know was she? They were homeschooled still, right? Or uh, home instruction, where you call it with the on the computer instead of actually going there. And I heard that was because of CPS to avoid CPS because every time they'd go get enrolled in in a school, the CPS would immediately go to their house for the stay of the children. Spooky places. Well, you ain't supposed to be here. I'll sit in my bedroom. No, 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 no. I'm planning not to get high. I'm planning not to have sex. I know the rules. You know, I'm planning not to be like, I'm going upstairs. I'm not going to do that shit. So I'm not going to get killed. That's right, Patty. Uh, okay. I know I, the rules. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. I'm not gone because I already know how that shit works. Uh, no, I'm good. <laughs> I no, know you were saying. <laughs> I don't think I don't think Florida's like Silent Hill. I I I lived there twice in my life. One in Panama City, one in um Holiday, Florida. Yeah, she don't seem all, all tore up tore up about it. Florida, That's for the, sure. Near Tampa. That's the best way how I can say it. It's like, gonna get real weird real soon wow. down there with all the stuff there. Imagine like, what they learn. Because it's considered to be like. I know my son William. He does not want to move there. He's like, Mom, I'm gay. Like, uh, yeah, I know. God, it's oh yeah, awful. they're crazy down there now. With the new SCOTUS ruling, they're planning to uh, basically make gerrymandering overall uh, legal, and also they're uh, going to let them decide the elections. So pretty much. Even if the people do vote for a blue candidate, they could turn around and like, no. Hey, you hear like how she talks about her own child, like, oh, he's like this. And like, you know, if he told you that, you know, that should be between you and your your child, not for the whole internet to hear. Like, seriously, Shannon, it's not like they're going to live with you anymore. 
So, and it's not like you can get your poor ass to Florida anyway. We don't like that. Seriously, guy. Uh, we're going to invalidate your vote. And we're going to put this guy in instead. Yeah, it's, it's, that's it's, cheated. That is why everyone like that's everyone awesome, thinks Patty. that all these other rulings were nothing but smoke screens. So that way, this could potentially right. slip underneath the radar. But people are letting it be known what's going to happen. It's like, like people are. Uh, are Overall yeah, thinking that's well. That's that their sandal the fun. Civil war because when these red states um, get this room, <laughs> what's going to happen is is that if they decide, and with the electoral college, if they decide that they don't want a democratic president, they can just overturn all the votes, even if it's the popular vote, and put in whoever they want in. You and know what, though. This is my take on p politics. Fuck both parties. Oh, oh that's <laughs> literally fuck literally. both parties. Fuck both of them. Oh, fuck the whole political system. Like fuck that shit. Right in front Anarchy, of Anarchy, man. Uh, that's pretty much what we get into. So everybody's pretty much seeing the writing on the wall, and none of it looks <laughs> right. Like right, right whenever they start sending all this uh. money over to. Ukraine for their issue, and then it's very odd that all of a sudden they are taking all these Ukrainian refugees off the get go it directly into um, into the United States without needing a full vetting process. It's basically getting them set yeah. up to be permanent residents here. Well, the thing is, is I gotta get um, a copy. I'll download it after. <laughs> they they say the Russians say the ukrainians are the german n-word you know what i'm saying what? i can't no. say that on instagram well so the, don't the, say that on instagram you can't well wow just knowing that she would <laughs> she she's a real stand-up person right folks say that word on instagram well the <laughs> thing is they're just trying to Awful. justify it and even though yeah, justify their actions for why they're doing the invasion um basically what putin wants is to bring back the good old days of the ussr ukraine is a big part of that plus their natural resource that sits on their land so he wants that back into the fold <laughs> and yeah you he heard wants that to basically <laughs> show the world that he that, that the russians of far more dominating superpower in the United States and yes yeah, it's already getting weird I think it was planned for a long time long time <laughs> because you remember when they were talking about Ukraine with with um Joe Biden's kid a long time ago and Hillary was involved with it oh yeah and then and then and then and then you got Trump being impeached because of Ukraine, like it, it, like it's been planned since the very beginning. They wanted us to have Ukraine in our minds. What? Well, I I pretty much was done with Ukraine when they. Were going she said two story houses are outlawed in Florida. <laughs> so they could say I can't get up them. When people were trying to leave the country, right? And they basically forced the Nigerians, the Jamaicans, and basically anyone black to wouldn't allow them on the train. Instead, they were all they were letting the Ukrainians on and their pets and forcing um, all the black people to basically wait until they were ready to let them go. It 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 was pretty pretty blatant, and it's like it's not very serious. Like there's the big surge of. Um, Maybe they are Germany's N word. Wow. God, no, no, yeah. For doing yeah. that shit. Seems like it. The, well, we don't know if there's been any um, war crimes have been committed by Ukraine that we don't know about. But a lot of people in the black community pretty much run them off. Awful. Like, yeah, it's the same thing <laughs> as everywhere else. And, you know, we just don't care. Like that's basically the stats. Is like after we saw that, we were, at first we were taking pity on them, 
And then after that <laughs> incident in the news. I know, right? and Donald Trump and Ukraine and, and Joe Biden and, and his son. And then Donald Trump was impeached. Like, what? what? What are you talking about? Who tells you this stuff? Stories came out and that basically. Um, they opened the stairway. Why didn't line, they stuck her up? Uh, I know, right? Kick her through it. A dog. Oh, stop a eating, Shannon. You're grossing they were, me out. They were, yeah, we're done. We don't care. They can rot. And that's pretty much the sad thing. I know. Says. That, well, that's why when I think when, when, when she does, when she tries to apologize for anything like that, it's like, yo, you, this is who you are. You like saying that, like, so much. You you just like being racist so much. You're like, oh, if it wasn't for Instagram, oh. <laughs> but, yeah, she, she's awful. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. See, this is what happens. I, I'm unfortunately a Oof. global political nerd, so I pretty much follow everyone. Like right now, there's uh, she definitely uh, picks at that. Uh, Britain lost their prime minister to a sex scandal. Mm -hmm. uh, so Johnson, who was basically the British version of Trump, is pretty getting, much is getting ousted, and then there is a young female i don't know maybe rev was, that is rumored to be possibly the becoming yeah. prime minister <laughs> trying to think uh, the, the the assassination of the abby was that actually did it actually was it successful or not successful i can't it I, was I, successful I, he died abby died Shani. yeah and that was great man Jap japanese prime minister correct yes Maybe she so thinks those things, Mr. Happened. Unite, you know? China has pretty much uh, <laughs> celebrated his death accordingly in Japan, and China's had racial... Oh, you see that? Yeah. Even though... Oh, real yeah, look what you're doing to Taiwan, and then talk shit, China. Yeah, but the funny thing is, they're all pretty... They all are Asian overall, and the fact that, you know... One lives on the island where one lives on the mainland, and they're still going out. This makes no sense. But they've had historical issues with that. They've been at war with each other forever. So, I mean, yeah. they used to he have knows. their own version of segregation where a certain he's jealous. would say, like, no dogs, no, chi uh, no Japanese uh, yeah. allowed. Yep. Yeah. That, that's basically how that works. <laughs> <Yeah>. mm -hmm. <laughs> it's bad. They went to, and that level of, you know, hostility is still present to this mark day. And uh, Japan is isn't considered to be a super because They're supposedly not allowed to have. Well, and she's like spilling the food all over herself. Did you see her just drop all that half of that? I can't stop staring at the warts though on her chin. Uh, Both chins. You know, Both sides. Type of military, but they have what they refer right, to as security like, Come on. force to work around that. Do something crazy, Shani. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> she has no idea what he that, said. <laughs> I see that, that, um, part of the treaty being made null void. Yeah, it's terrible. Overall. Yeah, this is the funny part, right? Like America made them do that. Yeah, like, I think he's doing that purposely to mess with her military superpower again. But they didn't do the same thing to Germany. Like Germany was allowed to have their own military she breathes, in the yeah. <laughs> and considering what they oh on... yeah, look at that. <laughs> look. Hey, <laughs> yo, lady, get off the internet, man. You just you, you, you don't got a good internet face. <laughs> Um, Japan overall, Oof. Mm -hmm. it, it, Those four plus teeth. the era that was, it's definitely <laughs> suspect that, you know, we pretty much committed a war, <coughs> overall war crime, uh, and, mm -hmm. and we justified it, but nonetheless, it's funny that, you know, very few brown countries, quote unquote, if you get my meaning, are allowed to have any form of... She's just in, power. you know... Ice Say cream heaven Africa, right now. Africa overall does not mm -hmm. have, or, or overall not going to be allowed to have any nuclear 
uh, capabilities, from my understanding. I don't even think South Africa. Dude, they're not even allowed to have a water pipeline in Africa. Yeah. The black one? <laughs> the, the one on the left? Like what? You remember with Gaddafi, he was op he was building a water pop pipeline yeah. for Africa. You see that? <laughs> so all yeah. Africa can have running water. U.S. nicks that. <laughs> Well, they got to keep Africa overall segmented and divided because if Africa unilaterally united overall, they would pre and, and due to their land mass. Yeah, she looks like Billy the Fridge. Dominating everything <laughs> because I know have like a good portion of all the natural resources for majority of most electronics. Um, it's the same thing that yeah. was over in uh, Afghanistan. Look at that hair. Look how it's just standing on end. Meant for uh, <laughs> electronics that they discovered. Water pipelines in Africa are illegal. <laughs> what are they talking about? And, uh, yeah. We saw yeah. how that turned out for modern day Vietnam. Look in their chaps. It's all blood money that they just. I hate what they're doing to Africa. Oh, it's been an ongoing thing, and they, and they do completely differently because when they have that, uh, yeah, that's that's greasy. In Paris, and that's all greasy sudden, there, folks. The fly the uh, color Paris and everything else a similar. It's <laughs> a higher part of yeah. Happened. yeah, and there was zero news coverage. And what a journalist said that I saw on YouTube said, "Well, unlike uh, see." Uh, we don't have the same relationship as we do with Africans as we do with our uh, allies in Paris. And I'm sitting, or allies over in France, and I'm like, oh, you all get crap loads of natural resources and everything. Yes, yes, Amanda. Um, he seems to have a variation of Stockholm and not realize he's going to come. Yeah, eventually. Well, remember, Rev, this is the first person Rev's ever been with intimately. Before that, he was with a uh, what you would call a real doll or a some sort of love doll, and that was it. He was living with his mom until his mom passed away, and he was left all this money. So he's lived a very sheltered life. He never had to work, never had to have a job. So yeah, there's definitely some sort of mommy slash Stockholm issues going on. But yeah, people have tried to get him out. That's why they always say, "Hey, Rev, run, Rev, run," <laughs> and they've uh, people have have offered to give him money to get him on his feet to get him to a hotel until he can get on his feet so yeah there's been many, several attempts to get him out on the to no avail you have a history and don't even get me started on overall history between the united states and africa overall but we also have the same relationship no you have an abusive relationship with africa you want everybody to forget about it <laughs> exactly exactly and that's when I was like, yeah. Uh -uh. I think he's, I think he's trolling there. Well, <laughs> the whole let, let's just <laughs> let's just go back to the Democratic Party. How wonderful they okay. are! You know, they're, they're no different than Republicans. <laughs> the whole After Gaddafi died, there was more Sudanese people that were put underneath yeah, crazy. Uh, Sudanese slavery. People than any other fucking time hillary i think he's also 37 like her he did that hillary clinton started slavery in in sudan hillary so like <laughs> what laughing like a monotical batman um he died <laughs> yeah what he psycho came, bitch. Came, we conquered he died and like like super villain laughter and whatnot. Now, don't get me wrong, Gaddafi was not a saint, but he was about to basically come up with his own currency yeah. that was going to be backed by actual gold, which would have destabilized the world. Rev ain't no prize. Well, his, now he's his, broke. His people yeah. will do, were doing amazing, too. Well, that's what happens. You know, they, <laughs> we go into the countries and we take out. We, we claim things underneath the things of democracy, but the thing is, 
we destroy the entire infrastructure yeah it's, then it's we been don't crazy do any form of repairs like we did for germany after yeah you destroyed a, a country that was <laughs> right in the moon's a hologram <laughs> rich uh, i i have 27 seconds remaining sorry my hour is up all right i will see you around you need to get a discord made uh, uh, I yeah. tried that once. I'll tell you what happened. It's awful. All right, I'll call you through Instagram then. Uh, I'll try. I'll tell you what happened. It's awful. That 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 that's what happened. No, she was flirting with guys and she got in trouble, like she always does. All right, love you guys. Peace, guys. Jenny, shut up. <laughs> All right. Well, on that note, um. I'm going to call it for the night, but uh, thanks for everyone being here. Uh, my final thoughts is, I don't know, I, I, I was listening to two Morrisons talk for about 20 minutes. So, yeah, that was, that was a lot. Is it too much for her? That, that could try to show, yeah, <laughs> it could be. I'm going to tell you about my experience on, 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 on Discord. It was horrible. Yeah. <laughs> wow, that's a great story. Uh, well, I don't know what Discord she's talking about. I thought, didn't she get in trouble? Like she was flirting with somebody or something? But yeah, that's it for tonight. Thank you guys for all for coming. Please like the stream. Oh, and remember, um, um, somebody like, uh, if, uh, what's her name? Uh, not Slurry Juicer. Um, there's a there's a thanks at the bottom of underneath all my videos. It's after a video is done. I don't know if p for people who are new here, there's like a thanks that you can donate to after the video is even over. So just to let everyone know if no one knew about that. But yeah, guys, thanks for coming. And I will see you on the next one. Have a good night. And if you do appreciate it and you want to donate and you see a video of mine, and you're like, yo, that was really funny. Like I said, just click on that thanks. Is YouTube don't give me no money. <laughs> Not really. But yeah, have a good night, guys. <laughs>